The BYA-1 by Beyond Aero is a groundbreaking hydrogen electric business jet concept, aiming to reshape the future of zero-emission aviation. Ditching traditional batteries, it runs entirely on a hydrogen fuel cell system that generates 2.4 megawatts of power to drive twin rear electric duct fans. Its streamlined, aerodynamic design enhances both performance and safety without high-pressure fuel lines running through the cabin making it as secure as it is efficient. Built to accommodate 6 to 8 passengers, the BYA-1 will travel up to 800 nautical miles at speeds reaching 360 knots, covering the vast majority of regional business routes in Europe. With certification targeted for 2030, it's set to become the world's first hydrogen electric light jet in commercial service. Beyond Aero's vision goes beyond innovation it's a bold step toward clean, sustainable aviation without compromising speed, range, or luxury. The Jet Zero Z4 is a radical leap forward in aviation, featuring a futuristic blended wing body that merges the fuselage and wings into one seamless structure. This innovative design slashes fuel consumption by up to 50%, reduces emissions, and enables flights of up to 5,000 nautical miles bringing sustainability and range together like never before. With room for around 250 passengers, the wide, open interior offers a spacious and modern flying experience that feels more like a lounge than a traditional aircraft. Backed by major industry names including United Airlines, Delta, and the US Air Force, the Z4 represents a powerful shift toward cleaner, more efficient air travel. Jet Zero plans to launch its first full-scale test flight by 2027, aiming for commercial service by 2030. If successful, the Z4 won't just be another aircraft it could redefine how the world travels. The Aero HT land aircraft carrier is a groundbreaking fusion of electric mobility and personal air travel. This innovative system combines a six-wheeled electric van with an integrated autonomous EVTOL aircraft housed in its rear compartment. With the touch of a button, the compact aircraft deploys six propellers and takes flight supporting both manual and autonomous flight modes. While on the ground, the van not only transports but also recharges the aircraft, bridging the gap between road and sky travel like never before. Debuted at CES 2025, this futuristic mobility concept has already attracted over 3,000 pre-orders and is slated for production in 2026. Priced under $300,000, the Aero HT land aircraft carrier isn't just a bold vision, it's a functional step toward everyday flying vehicles, redefining how we think about personal transportation. The Quarterhorse MK-1 from Hermius is a breakthrough in hypersonic flight, showcasing the future of ultra-fast, uncrewed air travel. Powered by a GE J85 turbojet engine, this sleek demonstrator completed its first flight in May 2025 at Edwards Air Force Base just 204 days after the project start. Built to test high-speed takeoff and landing, the MK-1 lays the foundation for aircraft that could one day connect New York and London in as little as 90 minutes. This milestone marks only the beginning. The upcoming MK-2 is targeting speeds up to Mach 2.5 later this year, pushing boundaries even further. With its rapid development cycle and bold performance goals, the Quarter Horse program is changing not just how fast we travel but how fast aerospace innovation can happen. Virgin Galactic is turning the dream of spaceflight into a real experience for everyday explorers. Founded by Sir Richard Branson, the company made history in 2021 when Branson flew aboard the VSS Unity, marking its first fully crewed spaceflight. Its spacecraft uses a dual-vehicle launch system where a carrier aircraft lifts the spaceplane to high altitude before releasing it to ignite its rocket giving passengers a few exhilarating minutes in microgravity and stunning views of Earth. Operating from Spaceport America in New Mexico, Virgin Galactic has already flown several commercial missions and is now preparing its next-generation Delta-class spacecraft for future journeys. With plans to expand access to space, Virgin Galactic is not just launching people beyond the atmosphere, it's opening the door to a new frontier of exploration and possibility.
The GAC GOVE is a bold glimpse into the future of urban transportation, blending electric mobility with autonomous flight. Revealed at GAC Tech Day 2023, the GOVE Short 4 GRC on the Go Vertical EV features a dual component design a six-wheeled electric ground vehicle and a detachable flight pod capable of vertical takeoff using 12 electric motors. With a flight range of up to 200 kilometers, it offers seamless air-to-ground transitions while the ground vehicle autonomously returns to serve as a charging station and landing pad. After completing over 400 flight tests, GAC plans to begin public demonstration flights by 2025 and targets full commercialization by 2027. More than just a futuristic concept, the GOV represents a transformative step in smart mobility where commuting means taking off, landing, and recharging all in one system. Lockheed CL-1201 In the height of the Cold War, Lockheed envisioned one of the most radical aircraft concepts ever conceived, the CL-1201. This nuclear-powered flying aircraft carrier was designed to stay airborne for over 40 days and act as a mobile airbase in the sky. With an immense wingspan of 1,120 feet and a takeoff weight nearing 6,000 tons, it was planned to carry up to 24 tactical fighter jets. A powerful 1,830-megawatt nuclear reactor would keep it aloft, with 182 vertical lift engines used for takeoff before transitioning to four nuclear jet engines for long-duration flight. Although it never left the drawing board, the CL-1201 was a daring leap into the future of strategic air power. The idea faced insurmountable hurdles from the dangers of airborne nuclear power to massive engineering complexity and cost. Still, it remains a striking example of Cold War era ambition, showcasing how far engineers were willing to push the boundaries of aviation in pursuit of global dominance. The MQ-9 Reaper is one of the most formidable unmanned aircraft in modern military operations. Designed by General Atomics, this high-altitude, long-endurance drone can fly for over 27 hours at altitudes reaching 50,000 feet. It's built for both surveillance and combat, carrying an arsenal that includes Hellfire missiles and laser-guided bombs. Its advanced sensors and real-time targeting systems make it a powerful asset for tracking and eliminating threats with pinpoint accuracy. Operated remotely by trained crews on the ground, the MQ-9 provides critical intelligence and strike support across global missions. From reconnaissance to direct engagement, it offers unmatched versatility and persistence in the field. The Reaper has become a key player in modern air power, stealthy, precise, and always watching. Vertical Aerospace is shaping the future of air mobility with its revolutionary electric air taxi, the VX-4. This all-electric aircraft can take off and land vertically, offering a quiet, zero-emission solution for short-distance travel. Designed for four passengers and a pilot, the VX-4 can reach speeds of 150 miles per hour with a range of around 100 miles ideal for fast, efficient transport between cities or across urban areas. The VX-4 made history as the first flying taxi to operate in open airspace in Europe. With over a pre-orders from global airlines like American Airlines and Virgin Atlantic, and strong backing from the UK government, Vertical Aerospace is preparing to launch commercial services by 2028. It's a bold or a cleaner, faster way to move through the skies. The Volonaut Airbike is a revolutionary leap into personal flight, offering the thrill of jet-powered travel in a compact, rider-friendly form. Created by Polish inventor Tomasz Patton, the mind behind Jets in One, this futuristic hover bike is powered by four microturbines and stabilized by an intelligent flight computer. With no wings or rotors, it reaches speeds up to 124 miles per hour while offering automatic hovering and intuitive controls, making it surprisingly easy to fly even for newcomers. Weighing only 30 to 40 kilograms thanks to its ultralight carbon fiber and 3D printed frame, the airbike is roughly seven times lighter than a typical motorcycle. Its open-air design provides a breathtaking 360 degrees view, delivering an unmatched sense of airborne freedom. The Volonaut Airbike isn't just a flying machine, 
it's a glimpse into the future of personal transportation. The Cirrus SR Series G7 Plus is a bold evolution in personal aviation, blending state-of-the-art technology with refined luxury. Leading the way in safety, it introduces the Garmin Safe Return Autoland system, an industry first in its class that can take over and land the aircraft automatically during an emergency. The pilot's experience is elevated with the Cirrus Perspective Touch Plus avionics, offering a high-resolution, touchscreen interface for clearer navigation, communication, and control. Inside, the SRG7 Plus sets a new standard for comfort with a redesigned cabin that includes upgraded materials, versatile seating, powered headset ports, and USB-C charging throughout. Powered by a 315-horsepower turbocharged engine, the SR22T variant delivers impressive performance, cruising at 213 knots with a range of over 1,000 nautical miles. Whether for business or personal use, this aircraft is not just about getting from point A to B it's about reimagining what flight can be. The solar-powered aircraft is rewriting the rules of aviation by offering clean, continuous flight at high altitudes all without a single drop of fuel. These innovative flyers operate in the stratosphere, soaking up sunlight through advanced solar panels by day and switching to battery power by night. Designed to stay airborne for weeks or even months, they combine ultra-lightweight construction with zero-emission performance to create a new frontier in sustainable aviation. More than just flying machines, these aircraft serve as next-generation platforms for global connectivity and observation. They can provide internet access to hard-to-reach areas, assist in disaster relief, track environmental changes, and perform high-altitude surveillance all without the need for satellites or runways. Already in flight, solar-powered aircraft are proving that the skies can be cleaner, smarter, and more connected than ever before. The Northrop B-49 Flying Wing was one of the boldest experiments in aviation history, a jet-powered bomber that broke away from conventional aircraft design in dramatic fashion. Emerging in the post-World War II era, this tailless marvel stretched 172 feet from tip to tip and packed eight turbojet engines into its sleek frame. With top speeds approaching 500 miles per hour and high-altitude performance near 50,000 feet, the B-49 was built for long-range missions and cutting-edge aerodynamic efficiency. But the future arrived a bit too early. The aircraft's radical design created serious flight stability problems, particularly during bombing runs, and one tragic test flight in 1948 ended in disaster when a prototype disintegrated mid-air. Though the program was eventually shelved, the B-49 left a lasting legacy. Its all-wing design directly inspired the iconic B-2 Spirit stealth bomber decades later, proving that even abandoned visions can shape the skies of tomorrow. The B-1 Lancer, nicknamed the Bone, is a high-speed heavyweight of the U.S. Air Force and an enduring symbol of strategic strike power. First taking to the skies in 1986, this sleek bomber features a unique variable sweep wing and four roaring afterburning engines, propelling it to speeds over Mach 1.2. Designed to deliver up to 75,000 pounds of precision-guided munitions, the B-1B combines the payload of a heavy bomber with the agility of a fighter, making it a formidable force in global operations. More than just a relic of the Cold War, the B-1 continues to prove its relevance in today's fast-changing battlefield. Equipped with advanced radar, electronic countermeasures, and all-weather capability, it can evade enemy defenses and strike with pinpoint accuracy. From combat missions in the Middle East to recent live-fire drills near the Korean Peninsula, the bone shows no signs of slowing down. With ongoing upgrades, it's poised to serve as a vital asset in America's air arsenal well into the 2040s.